Look at this new aerial video showing all that remains after the deadliest and most destructive wildfires in our state's history. Neighborhoods reduced to ash and rubble. This morning, a growing number of people who survived the fire and lost everything say they plan to sue PG&E. Last night, they met with lawyers who specialize in helping people impacted by mega fires. We still don't know what caused the massive fire this morning, but some lawyers are pointing to two incident reports filed by the utility company the morning the fire started, showing there were two separate power line outages in the area. The fire is now 70% contained. Meanwhile, the big concern over the next few days for this area is rain. The National Weather Service has issued a flash flood watch for the scorched town of Paradise. And as you know, rain could trigger ash flows, mudslides with all that vegetation now burned away and water rushing down those ash covered lands and, and hills because that soil can no longer absorb the water.